Hey, welcome back. It is Food Truck Friday, of course, and uh, we have Sweet Madeline's Donut Truck in the house today. Yay! And we're keeping it in the family because Abriel, hello Abriel. Hello Abriel. Nice, nice to meet you. you. My hands all wet. Her, Sorry. Pa her parents, can't. she's the daughter of Jim and Megan, who were here on Wednesday with Lil, uh, Grandma Lil's ice cream, ice cream truck. Ice cream truck. It's ice cream like a whole, and, and we've got Ariel as well. Yes. So you two are best friends. Yes. yes. And you, you, are you just best friends because your first names are so similar? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> and they play basketball together. And you play basketball so together. So where'd right, you guys terrific. grow up? Newington. Yeah, Newington. Newington. That's wonderful. And where is this truck based out of now? This truck, I now live in East Hartford, so it's based out of East Hartford, but I don't have a storefront. I just go all over. You so, go all over. Yep. Any events, any fairs, private parties. You do private parties? Yes. Have you ever done parties. a wedding? Yes, I've wow. done one wedding. Love, you've done one wedding? One she wedding. wants to do more weddings. I want to do more <laughs> weddings. You know, it's kind of a new trend, What are you right? doing? I just noticed this. <laughs> you want to take a bite out of the donut? Um, you know, a lot of people are doing donuts instead of cake. Yes. Which is huge, or even some like late night snacks too, yes. right? Or cupcakes, or cupcakes. Mm -hmm. So, what was the inspiration behind opening up a donut truck? Um, I knew the previous owner, um, my god sister. Um, her mom was the previous owner, and I just asked her one day if she was selling it because I've always liked owning businesses, and I like how every day is different. So I, like I called how you're her an one entrepreneur day. at yes. a young age. Definitely. <laughs> it's amazing. So I just bought it from her and took all the advice from her that I could get and went with it. That's amazing. And look at who's in the donut truck now. Yes. <laughs> Anybody got a donut? <laughs> so what are you known for? Apple cider donuts? Apple cider donuts and our sugar raised donuts. Those are the ones that are right here. Those are the ones these that right are here? the favorite. No, these ones right oh, here. The so sugar apple raised. cider and then sugar raised is in the got back. It. Those go like crazy. Everyone loves them. Well, you know we're just going to have a sample one. Is that, what is, which one is that? This is apple cider. Apple cider. How many different varieties of donuts do you have? Did, um, did we ask I, that question already? I like to change no. up the flavors. So I will try any flavor. Right now I just added chocolate frosted, maple frosted, and Ooh. then strawberry frosted. And do you make the donuts in this truck? Yes, everything gets made in the truck. So the dough will get put back there, and then it goes right through the machine and then onto the cooler. That's amazing. Yeah. I don't know what it is, but there's something to be said about donuts here in Connecticut. It just yes. seems like pizza and donuts are super on point here in Connecticut. Yes. It's definitely, uh, with the apple cider especially, it's just a taste of New England. You cannot beat it. Mm -hmm. How are you involved? Yeah, Ariel. Um, so I'm just supporting her. Sometimes I'll help out with her social media and like make flyers for her and mm -hmm. stuff. Um, well, but we saw you in the truck earlier. Oh, yeah. I do help stuff? make the donuts, wow. too. Yeah, so if you guys want to try any of the donuts, we I want her to make any more of these. She'll go back there and make them for you. What is this? What's the icing? That on this? one is maple frosted, oh. and then it has the maple syrup um, glazed frosted. on top as well. Oh my so god! Sugar. Uh, uh, and uh, it's dripping on my head. <laughs> and what is this? An Oreo donut? Yep, Oreo. That one is probably another like second best. Those ones, oh, I usually sell out of those. Where are you going to be this weekend? Um, I don't have an event this weekend. Oh, I, so you're next, available? Yes, I am available. So mm. if anyone wants a private party last minute, I always say yes. <laughs> always. And you, we want to thank you because you said yeah. yes to us oh, on uh, Wednesday. Day. We had a late last minute cancellation. You yeah. were kind enough to step in, so we're thanking you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank yes. you. Yes, and you also offered some drinks too, right? Yes, so I don't have the drinks today. I have strawberry lemonade if you guys want any of that, and then I have regular lemonade. But for the fair season, I'm offering cold cider, um, iced coffee, hot coffee, hot this cider. This is not going any further than this. <laughs> I do have this one right here too. <laughs> That's the jumbo That's donut. That's the jumbo donut for the jumbo guy right here. Stop. I'm telling you. Oh. It looks a little ridiculous, so thank um, you. Uh, what do you get out of doing something like this? It's just the food trucks are so fun. Um, I think it's like the people. So the environment, I always love going to fairs, especially growing up in New England. It's <coughs> kind of like everyone always goes to all of the markets and all of the fairs, mm -hmm. and you never get a customer that has a frown. So it's like yeah. you're just serving a smile to everybody, and I love that. And Grandma Lil's, do you team up with Grandma Lil's? And I, do you guys do food trucks and things yeah, together? Yeah, so we, sometimes we are at the events together. It is very fun when I get to be at the same one because it's I can run over and say hi, or if someone <laughs> wants to put ice cream on a donut, I can put ice cream oh. on a donut. Who was That's responsible for getting who involved in the food truck business? Um, I 
had a dream about this and then bought it. So then they asked me, they were like, can we start this ice cream truck? And I was like, more the merrier. <laughs> I mean, I would rather my competition be my family. Right, exactly. Right. Yeah. right. And we've all been learning together. This year has really been a learning experience for us. We're not even, we didn't even hit a full year yet. So no, you haven't hit a full year either. Not yet. No. Oh, oh you're kidding. Turn. No. So we're very. So this is post pandemic. Yes. <laughs> right after wow. the pandemic. Oh my that's God. That's amazing. That really is incredible. Are those fresh donuts? Yes. Yes. <laughs> All right, slop them out here. <laughs> slop them out. Oh my God! That, you what want is that one? I'll Oreo. take the Oreo. Okay. And then I will make you the maple syrup. This is Oreo. All right, it looks pretty decadent. Oh Ernie, you want some? Looks amazing. Here you go. How fun though! Who doesn't love donuts? It is so fun. I agree. And I love your truck, oh. too. Yes, we just painted it. So it was black before, but it's I wanted it to be pink. Just it's so it beautiful. Stays ours. It's Barbie pink. Yes, that was the goal. This she is absolutely amazing. You do like not know what you're missing. <laughs> All right, I love it. Thank you so much, yes, Ariel and Abriel. Yes. Thank you so much for being with us on Great Day at Nine. We so appreciate it. Very Get nice the donuts. To meet you. What's your information? Quick, give it out. Information. So all of our social medias are Sweet Madeline's on the go. We have Facebook, uh, TikTok, Instagram, and you can contact me with the phone number directly right. through there. All right. Have a great weekend. Oh, have a great weekend.